for me, makeup is everything. Form of art, happiness, and yeah, it makes me so happy. And I'm actually lucky to be, you know, working as a makeup artist. Yeah, even when I'm bored, like, what do you do when you're bored? When you when I do makeup, so. Plus, not only made of face, ma, I like to do makeup and others and try new looks and you know transform them and it's always exciting. What pushed you into the world of makeup? Like koi later you figured out ki la ma makeup artist one to one. So before this I used to uh, paint as well. I was a fine artist. Wow. Like school time they kine, I would and then slowly uh, you know I used to see magazine ko covers or my usila cover girls or and like the photo shoot and all. So I used to have this uh, color pens and you know paint go dine ka lipstick banai dine liner zaru banai dine. So that's how I started and I always loved doing that. Then I was lucky that my sister, she lives in New York and she used to send me a lot of stuff like, you know, makeup ko sama naru. Then I started doing it and got that. On your own first? Yeah, on my own first. And I was so interested doing that, you know, I used to do makeup every day. And then this uh, Instagram, uh, social media, I started uploading my own selfies with makeup. And then, yeah, I started getting uh DMs or room, makeup gardinus na banera and then then I found out oh makeup gold so I think I should just start this way. But I was planning to be a fashion designer before. Okay, did you did you study fashion designing? I did for a year but uh, I started makeup then I'm still studying fine arts. Studying money but uh, how do you manage time to study? <laughs> because you're so busy. Um <laughs> uh, I mean Exams are not so yeah, fine art is not that hard for me. Always. So, Lem, you worked in Nepal for one and a half years, if I'm not wrong. And this was you moved to Mumbai. But, connect Kosariboya. Can you connect the dots for us? Connect. So, uh, I was working here, like it was really good for me. I was doing bridals, I was doing celebrities, I was doing everything here. Then, it was a project, my, uh, I worked for them, and uh, models were from India. Uh, one is, she's still like my best friend in Mumbai, so she's Pranati, and another one is from Chennai. Uh, she's, the, she's the winner of India's Next yeah, yeah, Top yeah. Model. It's a really good friend of mine. So, they came here for the shoot. Then we went to Mustang for the shoot, like shoot Kolagi, and we were together. And you know, my uh, Meruti, I don't know, it's only with me, but I become friends with models so fast. So, entire Amra um, trip was really nice, and they became we became really good friends. And they were like, they, I did the, I did makeup for them, and they were like, your work is so nice at international level. Go, you should go out and explore. And your time, Matsi, I just realized, okay, um, you should. Yeah, I should. I should be doing this. You know, this is the right time to go out and explore. Right age, right energy. Everything so perfect. So I should just go and you know explore. So I came back from the shoot, and I just thought of it. I went to Mumbai to see the weather and everything for a week. I came back. I loved it so much. I came back. I packed my bag and I left. <laughs> you left. I left. So without. Like, did, did you have any work that you were like, you just left? I just left. Uh, here to kill and so on, yeah. you left like that. Yeah. <laughs> wow. So what was your first project in Mumbai? Uh, so my, I got a DM from um, the Russian uh, photographer. She's Natalia. And uh, she said uh, she loved my work and let's work together. So it was really good for me. Then I went, I met her. We did test shoot and she loved my makeup. Then we started working from there and I became friends with models. You know, I told you, I mean, that's my thing. I've become friends with them like quickly and that's how it started. Have you faced any cross cultural issues while working in Mumbai? Because you are a Nepali, you know? Garuta Bhai also. You are adjusting into a new environment. So, what differences face? What issues face? 
uh, issues that, you know, because I'm lucky enough to be working with really nice people there, uh, like photographers, like models, they're all my friends. I have really good relations with them. Touch wood. Yeah, touch wood. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, uh, there's two issues they haven't faced, but uh, you know, I worked with international models there in Brazilian and Spanish and from different countries. So, language ma the problem so they don't speak uh, English. So we just do, mm, mm, you know, we still <laughs> speak. So it's fun instead. Like it's it's not a problem for me. It's always exciting and it's a different thing for me. We've talked about this earlier, but can you please elaborate? Like, quick quick clients say, "That me irritating one, Sunny." Can you share with us one of your worst experience? So, kasi this to just China, like the worst say touch with again, because I asked them what do they want. That ik di zana, you know, few even after asking them, and they don't know what they want, and. Like you know, they're complaining. They're they're confused about their look. So like, our red lipstick, like I didn't use, man, I don't know why. But later, I think pink was fine. Eh, pink line, a red, a thick thing, or like you know, they change their mind a lot. So that was so irritating for me. Yeah, and plus, I would just the season, my time for new, you know. So my like, do they go and shoot a red hair on the bride? Or if they're taking me three hours, then whole schedule would be yeah, big things. So. You've been working with a lot of big names in Mumbai now. Can you name a few? Well, Disha Patani and Huma Kureshi, Sanakan, Pranati Rai Prakash, of course, and Yulia Ventor, and um, and many more to come. And many more to come. Yes, of many more to come. So tell us about your personal life. Who is Lemmy when she's not working? Personal life, there's no much of like difference between me like working Lemmy or like you know. What uh, do you like to do and uh, you know? I do makeup on myself even when I'm not working, and I like to take pictures and uh, you know like exploring places, and I like to uh, go out and eat a lot like you. <laughs> I watch all your shows. Thank you. We should, go, we should go and eat sometime yeah, together. together. So, yeah. Lemmy, I'm sure you've gotten a lot of offers for um, acting and modeling too. What about it? Yeah, I got a few offers for movies as well and uh, for modeling. So modeling, of course, if it's you know photo shoots or okay, it's funny. If it's related to my makeup, then I would like love to do it. So if I get good offers, I'm really so into modeling. Me gorgeous. But acting, but say you know, the thing is, I'm so into makeup and I'm passionate about it. Acting, but say I'm not actually interested. You know, first thing that acting gorgeous, I would know that because I've never tried that side. Are you a good liar? <laughs> so if you're a good liar, you you will know how to act as well. <laughs> you should get into acting as well and do your own makeup, and get your get your wardrobe uh, from the from your own store. Oh, <laughs> how about that? No, not really because uh, acting I'm not interested, and I I don't think I would enjoy doing that you know as much as I enjoy doing the makeup. Plus you know I uh, like I want to explore more, and I just moved to Mumbai as a makeup artist, so. I want to reach Hollywood some way. So if I dust it a bit, I'll be able to do it. So I want to continue with the makeup. You're very busy, but have you taken time out to do anything other than makeup now? Yes, I have. I just opened a store, Jade Nepal. It's here, it's in Lazenbad. Yeah, so. So that's to have a fashion boy, eh? Um, how would you connect makeup and fashion? Which is a very simple question. Yeah, it's already connected. I know. <laughs> yeah, so uh, it's, it's a perfect blend, Banona. No, eh? You must be really happy with it. I'm really happy. Besides makeup, I like to dress up and you know, chitika pore in numan lagne. This toru pini like you know, I always love doing that. So just thought of this. Oh, 
yes, what is your take on um, men uh, putting on makeup, like casual makeup? Casual makeup, so uh, not like lipstick or liara and all. <laughs> It's uh, it's fine, you know. If they want to look good, and you know, skin make color correct, go not It's good. They can put foundation or they can put a little highlighter stuff like that, and they can you know brush their eyebrows. That one, the body, I wouldn't suggest, but that's it's okay, you know.